yeah, well, devastating really. Um, we had a target before we played to to not lose back-to-back -back league games, and technically we've done that and achieved it. But it was disappointing to lose so late in the game. Um, but look, we dust ourselves down, take positives from it. It's another point off that minus twelve, um, and then we have a little break, get some rest, and then just got to win the next game. Really, that's the most important thing now. Particularly because you could have gone two 0 up on a couple of occasions, not least with the effort that you had. Yeah, we. I thought we had a really good spell just after the goal. Um, I had a chance, and then Massimo obviously hit the crossbar. And you know, some days those go in, and some days they don't. Unfortunately, that was the latter, and and we got punished at the end. Um, but it was a tough game. I thought it was scrappy. Um, conditions wasn't great, and losing Shoy, and then Palms coming on, then losing Palms. Um, that didn't help, and then lost Tom. We had ten men. Um, I thought we showed real good character, great fight, great teamwork, but unfortunately, it just wasn't enough in the end. Just on that, I mean, Gary Monk has made a great deal about wanting to, to change the culture at, at Sheffield Wednesday over the course of the season, then into what we see now with a, that type of performance. How how would you assess that change? I think there's been improvements, but I think there's there's more improvements to be made, and I think we're doing that. The international break's always a good time to one get rest but then two work on things that you want to improve on um and we've been look we've been dealt a really bad hand this season um and we need to stick together and we're doing that so far so it was important to yes be disappointed in the change room but you know get your arms around each other and and, and push on because we've got a bigger target than just one game this season we need to first and foremost get out the minus and then kick on and look i still think this squad we have and the squad the managers put together um We've got more than enough to have a successful season. Um, what that what success is for us, we don't know, but I think we've got what it takes to get out of this problem. So what, what do you assess then? When you look back at this sort of relative pause for thought with the international break coming then, of the, the points hold so far? It's OK, of course. Obviously, another two points would have been better. We spoke about that um, before the game, saying if we win today, then that leaves us with the opportunity of back-to-back -back wins to get us um, back to zero. It's not the case, we're now seven seven away, so the next three games is what we're looking at. Um, and hopefully we can win all three and get in, uh, back to zero. And then I think that once that happens, it's a big weight off everyone's shoulders at the club. We can start looking forward and start, you know, um, pegging back points from the other teams that are below us. Um, but next game's the most important, we need to start that with a win.